guys, it's Chet Leather here. So I'm going to cook everything for them because tomorrow is my birthday. And I'm trying to be. What is this called? What is that? It's called a bone. You said they cut for me. I've never done this. But the time I'm going to cook over. Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, yesterday night was lit, I mean this morning was lit because it was by 3.45, we got to 3.45, and we had like 3.45 bitches in the back of the car, I'm like, then, 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 I said like, I don't get any 3.45 bitches for back on hotel, now leave me there. Wahala be like bicycle indeed. Hey, baby. What's up my darling MVPs and how are you all doing? Welcome back to Sail with Mimi Shosley Mimi where you get the gist. I see they do waiting. I see they hurt. Of course you know there is no sleeping on a bicycle on this channel. If you snooze you do what? You lose. Are you yet to subscribe to this channel? Or are you still sitting on a fat, long thing? Kindly pause right there, subscribe, and make sure you turn on the notification bell. If not, tell me, how do you want to get the gist brewing from the cooking pot? Like, how do you want to get the gist? I see the hot. First off, guys, shippers, you guys can never get tired. There is nothing shippers will never ship. In every housemate, there is a shipper. Both in Zanzio, in Titano, or in Niger, there is at least one shipper who, who really wants, oh, I wish these two people dated. Why did I say that? So Nelisa came out and was like, remember Saga celebrated his 31st birthday like two days ago or thereabouts, you know? And then Nelisa coming to realize that um, Saga celebrated his birthday, and I think maybe they are kind of close, they... they actually know each other when she came to nigeria they actually hung out you know one or two times together like in a public gathering and then she now said oh no it was saga's birthday and nobody told me people started posting the picture um where nelisa was wearing saga's suit, jacket or whatever you know see how she said it said it was saga's birthday and you all i didn't tell me that is you all didn't tell me you know and then people were like yo my sheep saga and nelisa i'm like yo she passed. Zukwani K. All right, still talking about shipping in the blood. Um, coming from Amelia of Komoni, I got to Kosi life late, and it looked like she was irritated about something. What happened, guys? What did I miss? Remarkable Kosi Twala King Kosi Twala forever. Kosi replied and said, "I need you to let this man get small rest." Meanwhile. Kosi had a life the other time, and I gisted you guys what she said. I did not just gist you guys; I shared the video where Kosi was actually putting out a warning out there and she'd be like please you guys should stop giving my credits to whom another person don't give my glory to someone else i am a lady that work hard you know i work hard for my money and i am being paid and i am i, I, I am spoiling myself nobody should give the glory to another person you guys remember when she said that and then not for her to go live i think the next day again people started with that notion again you see, some of these people do not hear what they started again. Who is that man? Who is there? You don't want to show some the person behind your trip. Blah 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 blah. Our daddy, our father. You know they've been saying our daddy, our father to Kosi since. Where did they see this daddy? That I've been asking. I want to know. You guys should show me who this daddy is, so that I will know. I don't know. You know. So Kosi seeing so much of those questions. In the comments actually really pissed her off she it was not long even me when i got the notification i immediately i joined you know for it was not even long she she ended the life because they were busy asking about something that do not exist even if it does and the person do not want to take you through it why not take your cool and respect the person's um space or whatever the person wish why actually forcing things that is not there to happen it's really unfair Anyways, um, people replied, people were asking her about man. What man now? How many times will she say she's single? They don't hear what. People do not hear what. They just want to provoke and do their thing. But last, last, all of them go do all right, including you and I that is just in about this right now. All right, coming from Yvonne. Thank you to my lovely Yvonne stars for my get worse package. So, guys, the Yvonne stars, it actually, oh, so sweet of them. Remember, um... Yvonne just recovered, you know, so they gifted her get worse soon gifts. That is so sweet of you guys. If you're Yvonne star, I'm sending a shout out to you guys. Now, talking about Yvonne, 
Yvonne and Juicy DJ, Yvonne Sheep and Sumjel, that is Suma and Angel, they are flying, they are proposing right now in Makeke's voice. Because this question was asked, quote this a photo of your favorite celebrity couple and guess what? It was filled with these two. It was filled with Javon and Sumjel. You know, I'm like, yo, it is giving the people sheep or gonna sheep as you guys. <laughs> It is giving the people she because why not? Why not? Why is the Javon and the Sumjel flying? Any which was talking about flying, hmm. Angel and Suma, they've started, oh guys, oh PDA don't PDA don't start again, oh public display of affection. As Angel posted, oh my god, Angel is so beautiful, she's so sexy, like oh my god. You know, baby girl posted, I know she has the body. You know, she posted a picture and then Suma said the one. People are like, yo, we are back again, you know. And then this one, you remember the video where uh, you shared here? A video of Suma trying to put up a disclaimer. You know, Suma had a gig, actually. He had a gig that he traveled, he went for it, you know. And then he came, after the gig, was a, a appearance, a kind of club appearance. When he came back, in the early morning, he was like, yo, he had fun, some bitches were there, blah, 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 blah. And then... He actually later said, no, nobody was in the car. Angel now said, you knew to issue a disclaimer because I was like, so people started sharing it and like, yo, so man don't want to wahala, so man don't want trouble. Now talking about so man don't want wahala, you know, somebody said, hi, Angel, can I buy you flowers, take you out for dinner, anywhere of your choice? Angel replied, I am married. Hmm, hmm, that is how Suma was like, we are, we are busy trying to make babies. Suma replied someone in the comment section, I'm like, hey, those people, you guys are, you guys are flying at this point. Are you guys trying to utilize what people were training about pregnancy right now? Are you guys joking? You know, they are trying to, you know, fly right now on the... <laughs> Oh my keke actually took my I actually took my keke's words so much. That's how much I love him, anyways. Any which ways, guys, it was given last weekend was all over, was between Angel and the Lebay. It was them together, having fun together. We saw them together at the party before Soma traveled. Almost um, these celebrities know the rest though. Before he traveled, yeah. They were together. Aha. Uh -huh. The next day he traveled, the other day he came back again. Anyways, um, they are calling Ile Baye the head shipper because Ile Baye was asking, is Soma coming back today? And all of those kind of things. One of the video Angel was making, she was asking, is Soma coming back today? And Angel was like, yes. They are like, oh, Ile Baye, you are our head shipper. The Som Jellers are actually hyping Ile Baye like crazy at this point. Meanwhile, talking about Baye, they've been dragging her. Because when they went for that Ash um, luxury event, right that it went for where she was with angel and all of that guys so there is these people that ask question about outfits and everything so they were asking her about her outfits the price and everything so most of them she was like he's from a brand i can mention their name yada 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 and then the one that stepped browse was the handbag they asked her she asked her the lady asked her how much the handbag is elebae was like take a guess and the lady was like i think it's above five thousand dollars that was what the lady said that it's above five thousand dollars do not forget five thousand dollars here is like five m plus or if not six m you know currently with um dollar rates right now so and the labor here said yes more than five thousand dollars that's how they started dragging her they are like yo the swan will not know anything because the girl asked her question about what inspired her outfit and she said she is gen z body that she 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 inspires herself that she's not looking at anybody she's not looking at this person no i want to look like this person and dress like this person that she's inspired by her own self as a gen z body they started dragging her they are like yo this girl don't know anything oh you're happy you spent more five thousand dollars on bags blah 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 and she called herself gen and bilonia you know a young bilonia people were like you are exaggerating you're lying why are you saying that you know all of those kind of talks <laughs> they are like how much are you paid how much gigs are, how much our brand have paid you blah 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 that you're saying you're in bilonia you know they were just saying a whole lot they're just flying you know how fans can be now meanwhile in ile Bayesin, seen all of the thingy people were saying she actually posted only this your perception about me isn't my reality ouch you know, she said, you guys can say whatever you want to say. You guys can think anything of her, that whatever you think about her is not her reality, that she's the only one that is living her reality. You can say all you want to say about her, but she herself knows what her reality is. She herself knows the exact thing about her life, that the rest 
is akukifo. You know, it tells by <laughs> guys akukufo in my language. It means tells by moonlight. Yeah, yeah. All right, Venita Abofure said, "Can't wait to wrap today. Taking a cute break from filming. It's been set back to back since November. God, thank you." And then some people were like, no, Venita, you don't, they run for work, continue, Jerry, blah, blah, blah. And then she said, no point shooting films that I can't attend the premieres for because I am busy filming on another set. I am exhausted and I need a holiday. So this is Venita Bofuri saying that at this point, she has overworked herself, especially with filming, you know. So right now she is due for a holiday. I'm like, that is what we pray for, baby, for you to be booked and busy back to back. It is so sweet to see that you are not busy and you're the one that is using your own hand and said, oh, more, I need to rest, you know? And it's a sweet feeling, you know, it's a good thing to see because, babes, that is what we want for you guys. You go out there and shine. All right, um, coming from Bibi Niger, Metro Niger. Once you leave Bibi Niger, you can decide how you want to further your life. You can be, okay, so we say trash as a podcaster, you can be doing okay i'm skipping that one you can go into academies like miracle or sports like ozo now i have a question guys i really this is a genuine question so i know some of you are standing miracle that is miracle book way of um the double wahala season and then some are standing ozo who congratulations is actually pouring in for recently but i have a question you guys make it look like only few persons from the bb niger alumni is actually worth celebrating Everybody must not go through the educational sector or whatever sector. But that does not mean you look down on others like they are also not worthy. To me, I think this is too much exaggeration if you ask me. Because if you see Miracle went MIA since how many years ago. But they still recognize him. They still call him the best. Why? Because he's a pilot. Do you get that pilot name tag? They actually call him the best. Do you think that is how it should be done? And you think others who are still in the industry, you think those ones, because you see them every time online, they are not also worth the hype. And you see their faith hyping them, and you say they're not rich this person, they're not rich that person. Any which way, this is just my take. Oh, I'm just airing my mind. I don't know what you guys think about that, okay? Just tell me how you feel, what you think, because the comment section is all yours. Because right now, I'm going to be dropping my voice to see you guys later. Thank you so, so much for always sailing with me. Bye for now, babies.